So the Visionary Leaders for Manufacturing is a very uh, novel program that was created in India for the world. It is a big departure from the conventional thought process of what manufacturing was, uh, which is pretty much considered as production going into a country that had been largely in a licensed manufacturing era to a global competitiveness that is emphasized. Way back in 2004-05 uh, when uh, a new regime came into the country, one of the first things that were created in my understanding is the National Manufacturing Competitiveness Council or NMCC and uh, the idea of the body was to determine mechanism by which the manufacturing competitiveness can be uh, largely leveraged. The Indian economy had been largely considered uh, an agro-based economy which got transformed into a service-based economy based on many service sector industries coming about. Uh, we have been traditionally good with a cottage industry and mechanism of finding a market for, in the world for the cottage industry was in play. But uh, looking at employing a larger proportion of the population in the country at a very good salary, uh, a mechanism of doing it is required, which is the requirement of becoming a good manufacturing leader or a hub for the world. A VLFM program, as many would be aware, was started as a mechanism by which leaders are developed for building up this manufacturing economy uh, in the country. Uh, manufacturing, as we were talking about, is not just production but uh, goes for the whole uh, cradle to grave uh, aspects of uh, making things which is from conceptual understanding to making a design out of it, doing adequate research and development to make a product of and then actually producing the product which is the production. The VLFM program had been uh, very novel and aptly aided by uh, Professor Shuji Shiba who had spent a substantial period of time building up the quality revolution in uh, uh, the US, brought together a unique mixture of three uh, nominally competing enterprises, which is the academia, uh, the industry, and the government uh, on the same table uh, to create something for the future of the country. And therein born this unique program, Visionary Leaders for Manufacturing. Uh, it was quite visionary, not because of these three domains coming into, but because three different universities or institutes for the first time together came around to offer a program jointly. I am Calcutta, IIT Kanpur and IIT Madras. The idea of VLFM is not limited by something that was started in one regime and forgotten when there is a regime change. Uh, VLFM was part of the NMCC's core agenda, became part of the Make in India agenda of the current regime. Uh, in fact, it was made as a mechanism of building the human capital that is required for bringing about the Make in India a success. It is one thing to bring uh, investments, generate opportunities uh, for uh, employment. But it is a totally different ball game to make sure that that uh, investment is leveraged adequately to not only uh, bring in businesses or low paying jobs but go into a broader understanding of managing the whole technology so that you can create new on entrepreneurs and businesses and products and processes in this country, in India, which will be for the world. VLFM is the one where we are trying to build technology managers for the future of the world. Uh, the technology managers have a good perception of what is the engineering behind aspects of uh, the manufacturing or the whole gamut of manufacturing as well as knowing the essential skills for managing it to take it forward. To sustain a manufacturing that can have the spectrum of people from 
the leadership that is required for strategizing from a conceptual stage to a end of a product to a, a training of people to be part of this great enterprise called manufacturing uh, is going to happen through leaders that are available and the VLFM program is going to be providing this leadership for uh, that opportunity of making make in India a feasibility. For the VLFM program, uh, it has been going good with the uh, majority of the students, which is basically trying to say, average exit salary is about two and a half to three times the average uh, incoming salary of the people uh, who have joined the program. And that's a good indicator of not just the program but also the Indian economy wanting to have more and more technology managers who can understand both technology as well as have the managerial training to go forward. The future of VLFM is not limited in making available a human capital to make Make in India a success but to actually create a mechanism of having the demographic dividend leveraged adequately to make India a superpower of the world. Jai Hind.